Hey, how you doing? What's your name, boo? Uh, I'm Bird. Your name is Bird? Yeah, well, my real name is Marcus, but they call me Bird. So they call you Bird? Yeah, how you doing? Good. Bird, I'm trying to get these comments. Um, um, Bird, where are you calling us from? I'm from H-Town. I'm from Houston, Texas. Houston, how old are you? 38. 38? Yes, ma'am. Bird, H-Town, Houston, Texas, 38. You have any kids? Yeah, I had like uh four kids. You have four kids? Yes, ma'am. Okay, how old are your children, honey? I got one 17, I got one that is 16, I have a 10 year old and a two year old. Are they all about the same woman? Nah. How many women? Four. So you had two so you had two kids by different women back to back, seventeen and sixteen. Well they well, the seventeen year old finna be eighteen and the 16 year old, she's finna be 16. You know, okay. it's like something like that. Yeah. Okay. And then the two year old, why are you not with her mom? Man. What we, is it a girl? Yeah, it's a boy. It's a boy. It's a boy. Why are you not with his mother? We recently just broke up. You know, it wasn't it wasn't like no uh infidelity or abuse. It was just we just started clashing. We were together about six years. So, you know, it just wasn't getting along. You know, we just started growing apart, I guess. Okay, I gotta bring up this hair because they're talking about it. Yeah. So, is it a Jerry girl? Uh, nah, it's it's just I got I got a friend. I'm mixed with French, so I got good hair. But when I uh wet it and I put like a certain mousse on it or something like that, it 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 just curls up like this. It's dry. Okay. He it's, wants y'all to know he got good hair. So yeah. when he makes his hair up, this is what comes out of it. Yeah, I normally have it different, but I, I just ain't got it done yet, you know. You just don't got it done yet. Okay, okay. So this is Bird Houston, 38, four kids. Uh, what do you do for a living? Like security work. Security Club, work. Door okay. clubs and, and, you know, security work, really. Okay. And yeah. what's your birthday or zodiac sign? I'm from uh, July 16th. I'm a cancer. All right, he's a cancer. All right, Bird, let's get to it. What kind of woman are you looking for? Man, loyal for one. Loyal, understanding, you know, not no female that don't work. Or I ain't asking for you to have a million dollar job, but at least, you know, have some kind of head on your shoulders, you know, and that's pretty much it. And looks wise, you know, vice versa, something that you got to be attracted to, you know. So other than that, I don't have no judgment on no skin color or none of that. Okay, what's some deal breakers? Uh, dirty. Uh, don't want to work with females that just don't want to do nothing. Uh, you know the ones that cheat. You know cheaters and shit like that. I don't and gold diggers. I don't like that either. You don't like gold diggers, okay? No. Um, so you dated a lot of women that are gold diggers? Not not so much as a gold digger, but like, say you meet somebody. And you got money, a little change on you, you're doing good. And you fall off and they disappear. Okay, you, I see what you're saying. Yeah, something like, you know, like that. You don't want nobody that's just going to be only there for the good times. And then when the bad times come, they disappear. Yeah. None of those women. All right. Because those women got to look a certain way. Presentable. You know, just pretty much hygiene. You know, like, like if you see a, a homeless person, you ain't going to look down on them, but you probably wouldn't date them. So you want somebody that's going to be presentable. You know, I can't just say looks wise because you can fall for any, you know, something that you wouldn't think that you would fall for, you know, but I would like for her to look presentable and just be clean, you know, and be a good person, like for real. Okay. All right. So Bird, does she have to make a certain amount of money? Nah, I can't judge her pockets because I can't judge as long as she's a, a worker and a go get as long as you just want more. You know, but I ain't. I can't just sit here and say you gotta have this and shit. I can't. Nah, that ain't for real. All right, for those who are just tuning in, he does not have a Jerry curl. He has good hair. He said he got French mixed in with him. So when he wets his hair, this is the style that yeah, he gets dry. naturally. Right, like it's dry right now. You know. <laughs> all right, so for all those asking, all right, but let's keep going. Yeah. All right, Bird. We first of all, why can we call you Bird? What is your real name? My real name, Marcus. You want me to call you Bird over Marcus? You can call me Marcus. Uh, that's just what I've been going by. You know, that's what that's my nickname, my street name. You know, but you can call me Marcus. Okay. Let's see yeah. the um. Let's do the Kendra Cam. That's when we see your full body. Oh, you want me to stand up? Okay. 
Shit, I mean, let me step. Do I need to step back or something? Yeah, step back so we can see your full body. All right, here you go. They said, okay, Becky, with the good hair. <laughs> uh, I know y'all crazy. Nah, but, uh, shit. Wait, what's going on? Trying to fix it for you, but, I mean. Just well, okay, you got to fix it, baby. We can't look at you like that. And then I got a question with this background. This is no, background I'm, with a sheet. Uh, I moved to uh, this is my sister them uh house. I'm over here fucking with them, and it's an empty room. But they they haven't her, her son moved out, so they moving his stuff out. So I'm just back here chilling, you know. But uh, I can go somewhere else so you can see me full body. If, um, if, it, it's we kind of saw you, but do you want to yeah. try somewhere else in the house? Yeah, yeah. ain't no thing. I got you. Oh, shit. Here you go, right here. I mean, I don't okay. know. Okay, like you in shape. Yeah, oh, yeah, most definitely. Like, it's pretty much. Okay. Yeah. So, do you have your own place, Bird? No. No. Not, not anymore. Like I say, uh, we fresh out of a relationship. So with that being said, you know, we moved apart. Oh, you was living with your girl? Yeah, we was living together. We been together for years. We got the one with the two-year-old, you know? So, oh, okay. We didn't, I didn't understand that part. So the one that had the two-year-old, when did y'all break up again? We broke up just, it's like, it wasn't just like a, a off the thing, just break up. We just grew apart. You know, it was like problems. But when did y'all, okay, when oh, did it months, end? Oh, three months ago. So for the last three months, where have you been living? With my sister. Okay, so this is where you currently stay? Yeah, uh, you know, yeah, you could say that, yeah. Okay. When but, you when I get well, I'm more, I'm more like, like I say, I'm more be, I don't really be here because I, I go to work. I, I go, you know, do my day to day. But when I come to lay down, I come here. Yeah, you can say that. Okay. So you put like, go ahead, sweetheart. No, I said it was temporary. That's it. Is that why you say you don't want to go zigger like a woman that's not going to be with you when things get yeah. rough? I'm gonna go get her. Like, if anybody was to look up my page, you will see. I, I don't play no games. I, I handle my business. It's just where I'm at right now. You know, like I say, me and her, we, we I go get it. I ain't playing. So I, I'm gonna be in the one bedroom soon. You know, but this way, you know, this way I got to start at. Got you. So you left your baby mama two, three months ago. You don't have to answer, but I'm gonna ask. When's the last time you was intimate with someone? With her. Her. So three months ago. Yeah. Okay. Why do you think you're single, Bird? Because me and her broke up. You know, that's pretty much it. Because I really handle my business, like, seriously. You know, that's just, you know, that's the only reason I'm single right now. And when we was together, I really wasn't, like, in people's inbox trying to, you know, mess with different females. So when we broke up, it, was, it wasn't nobody I had to run to. You know what I'm saying? I'm just starting from scratch. So that's pretty much why I'm single, though. And then I wasn't trying to rush into nothing when we first broke up. But this is the last breakup, you know. That's the last breakup. All yeah. right. So why would a woman be lucky to be with you, honey? Because I'm loyal. I can provide. I'm clean. I know how to cook. She, I have a good personality. You know, I'm a people's person. I have kids, so I, I, I don't look at people that have kids no different, and I don't mistreat them, you know. It's a lot of qualities with me, you know what I'm saying, like real shit. So do you want more kids? I wouldn't just sit here and say that I want more, but if it was to – come up and I'm doing good with my work, I'd be open to it. But if I'm not able to take care of it, I wouldn't want it at that time. Okay. And the woman can have kids you just mentioned, right? Yeah, yeah I can. Yeah. And what's the age range you would date? You're 38. Probably 35, 50, I mean, 40-something, like late 40s from 35 on up, you know, but not too old, like. 45, you know, 35, 45, something like that, because I'm 38. 35, 45? Yeah. Okay. This is Bird. Um, does he lives in Houston? Does security this woman gotta be in Houston? I would like that. I would like for that. I, okay. I mean, but I'm open, but I would like for you to be in Houston. You would like for her to be in Houston? Yeah, because that, that long distance is kind of I never did it before, so it's kind of weird to me. Okay. Um now you have four kids. Do you want to get married one day? Yeah. This yeah. is a question I ask women that are in your predicament at times. Four kids by four women, right? Yeah. So why don't you think about marriage before you had all your four children by four different women? 
All right. When I had, like I say, my oldest son, seventeen. I'm thirty eight. So when I started having them kids, I, I, I was, I was kind of still young at the time, and then that's why I hadn't had any more to my two year old recently, you know. So and then you plan to do that, but certain things happen. So I'm not like, I'm not like against it. It just didn't happen with the right person. You know what I'm saying? So, like I say, anybody can get engaged. I have been engaged before, but if it don't go right, then it, you don't get married. You know, so that's pretty much it. Okay, but you did it. You did. It, I don't want to call anything a mistake, but you did it with three different women, and then the fourth one. No, nah, see, with the that's why I say when I had my first three kids, I was young, so that was like. I don't count it as my older mentality. I had a younger mentality then, you know? So now with my two-year-old and now how I am now, I'm older with it. So I wouldn't just have a baby with nobody that I don't plan to marry. You get what I'm saying? But when so I'm, now after four women later, you, you make that rule? No, and not the four women later. It's just me getting smarter and, and more mature. I, I was, you know, I was, it ain't got nothing to do with the women. It was with me with my maturity. You get what I'm saying? So I'm now mature. Okay, fair enough. All yeah. right, let's do it. This is Bird in Houston, um, Texas. He works in security. 38 is a cancer. Four kids. He'll date 35 to 45. I right, Bo, what's your IG name? Uh, Bird123. Uh, Bird1, it's Bird SW123. Yeah, yeah. Bird, so the letter, the word Bird SW123. So B I R D. SW123. I right, boo. All right, you take it easy, mama. You be careful. Goodbye, baby.